students in Fairdale High School's education magnet got a chance to be teachers for a day, bringing first graders at Fairdale Elementary the Protecting You, Protecting Me program. Our brain is the most important part of our body. So we came to Fairdale Elementary today for Protecting You, Protecting Me. Our brain helps our heart to beat. We're here to tell kids how to be safe and always wear a helmet when they're on their bike or in the car where always have their seatbelts on. Tell me, where is the safest seat in the car or a van for you? The best way to develop our teachers was to have an experience where they could learn to work with young people, where they could teach something that is, not, is what our kids actually do need to know. When I was younger, I knew I always looked up to high school kids and always listened to what they said. My group taught the students about safety. They taught them about uh, bicycle safety, about wearing helmets. The safest seat is in the back. I always choose it. That's a fact. Just puppets like really helped like get the message across and like the rap that we did, that really got them like doing movements with them and like the I don't trust my life to luck like that really helped them out and like they got the message. I don't trust my life to luck. Well, they put on a show and it and they sang a song about never trust your life to luck. The safest seat is in the back. I always choose it. That's a fact. The play was like a little song so they know to help them keep in their mind how like the system works and the brain. They talked about the song, they sang the song and um, you never trust your life to luck um, and that you always have to um, protect your brain. I always choose it, that's a fact. Because they danced back and forth, they were excited, they were enthused. Uh, they love being able to role play for the children. They love being puppeteers. And it, it's a way of my children seeing that learning can still be fun, whether they're on as a teacher or as a student, learning should be fun on both sides. Uh, we used a song, a worksheet, and like little activities to make them raise their hand and thumbs down, thumbs up, so they can get a clue, so they can be more active, so they'll know. So I learned to protect your brain and to wear a bicycle helmet anytime you ride your bike, because if you happen to fall off your bike, your brain might get damaged. If you hit your brain, it will really damage your head. They use all three learning styles as far as uh, they use tactile or kinesthetic. They used auditory, they used visual. You, you were able to see, they were able to hear. Um, they tapped into modalities, they listened to them, they played music. They listen to high schoolers because some students don't listen to adults, so they'll relate more to high schoolers than adults. I wear a bike helmet. So everybody get some. At the end, we gave them bicycle helmets for them to play. Like when they're going outside to play, always protect themselves and always wear a helmet because some kids in my group said they didn't have one. I was like, well, you're going to get a surprise at the end. And now they're like, yeah, I can wear my bicycle helmet. This is a helmet and you, I'm going to wear it when I get home so I can ride my bike. 